In a reaction of a carbonate with an acid, it is said that carbon dioxide is given off. We are using lime water to test if this is true. Lime water goes cloudy if carbon dioxide passes through it, so we put some lime water into a test tube. We are going to test copper carbonate, so copper carbonate is placed in a test tube with a side arm. Notice that the copper carbonate is a green powder. Sulfuric acid is the common name for hydrogen sulfate solution. So the reactants are copper carbonate and hydrogen sulfate. A rubber tube will collect any gas given off in the reaction and bubble it through the lime water to test for carbon dioxide. The acid is mixed with copper carbonate and a cork on the top of the test tube means the gas is directed down the tube to the lime water. Notice the fizzing up in the test tube on the left showing that a gas is given off. Notice the gas bubbling through the lime water. The lime water has gone cloudy where the gas bubbled through, showing that the gas was carbon dioxide. This is how to test if a gas is carbon dioxide. Some copper sulphate helps us identify the stuff left in the first test tube. Notice that when copper sulphate dissolves in water it has the same colour as whatever was left in the first test tube. So copper sulphate is also a product of this reaction. So let's revise what happened. Copper carbonate reacted with sulfuric acid which is also known as hydrogen sulphate. The result was a gas which we could identify as carbon dioxide as well as the salt copper sulphate dissolved in water. So the overall reaction is copper carbonate and hydrogen sulphate goes to give carbon dioxide plus copper sulphate plus water.